In ancient days, noble knights roamed the land, doing good deeds and acts of service for their king. Many of those brave squires served the greatest lord of all, the King of Kings. Travel with us now as we ride with these mighty men of God on their quest for kingdom adventures. <laughs> Ah, good morrow to you children. It is I, Squire Gus. And Sir Praise the Lord has promoted me to knight in training and given me my very first official task. He has told me that I must stay here and keep watch of the castle gates and protect the kingdom from all of her enemies. Oh, Penelope, I want to do this right. Oh, I should consult the royal manual. Good thinking, Penelope. All right. I shall get out the royal manual right now. King of kings, and Lord of Lords. Ooh, never consulted the royal manual by myself before. Hmm. What page should I turn to? How does it work? Ah, I got it. I shall pray. Dear Lord, please give me direction. Look at this. This is about the time when Jesus had gone to the temple at the time of the Passover. And the Passover was a very special holiday for God's people. Ooh. But some men in the temple were selling animals for sacrifice at an unfair price. Imagine that. Cheating God's people in God's very own house. How disgraceful. But Jesus was very upset at this. So he threw the tables over and he chased them out of the temple. And he wouldn't even let them come back to even walk in the temple at all. Jesus quoted the Bible by saying, My house will be called a house of prayer for all nations, but you have made it a den of robbers. I think I understand. Jesus wants his temple to be a place of prayer. His kingdom is no place for dishonesty and making money for ourselves. Hello, hello, Mr. Knight. Uh, Mr. Knight, hello down there. Oh, I'm not a knight. I'm a knight in training. Oh, well, you could have fooled me. You sure look impressive there, the way you stand so bold and noble. Such, how do you say, je ne sais quoi. <laughs> oh. Thanks. I mean, thank you, kind sir. I do try my best to represent the kingdom. Oh, well, you are doing a wonderful job. You are almost the perfect image of a knight. Almost. Except you are missing just one thing uh, that would make the picture complete. Really? I am? Well, well, what is it? What is it? Tell me. You need a hat. A hat? We, oui, but not just any hat. You need a special hat. I have one that is made for a noble knight, and it will only cost you one gold coin. Ooh. I will bring it to you. Okay, well, yes, please do, but uh, a gold coin, that's very expensive for a hat. But I simply must have it. You see, kids, I'm so excited now because I will have a hat that shows me for the person who I am, an obedient and trustful and loyal knight to the king. Oh, Mr. Knight! I present your hat. This is a silly party hat. Oh no, this is a chapeau de soiree. Yes, it represents the joy and celebration we have in serving the king. Are you sure? Oh yes, I'm sure, of course. We oui. <laughs> would I lie to you? No, uh, I suppose not. <laughs> so one gold crown, is it? That's correct. Mm. Expensive, but uh, simply must have it. Here you are. All right, enjoy your chapeau, monsieur. Oh. Why, thank you. This is an excellent hat indeed. How do you like my new chapeau, Penelope? <laughs> Penelope, how do I look? Penelope, it is rude to ignore me and... Penelope! Where is she, kids? Did you see what happened to Penelope? The salesman took her? Ooh. I don't think that was a salesman at all. Well, that must have been Robespierre. Ooh, that sneaky sneakster. Ooh, I have to be a closer watch of the kingdom more than ever now. 
I know what I'll do. I shall climb up there to get a better view. <laughs> ah! Glasses for sale. Glasses for sale. Very special glasses. You cannot get them anywhere but here. Glasses for sale. Ah, huh? oh, very special night halt! glasses. Who goes there? Wait. You. Yes? Have you seen a sneaky robber anywhere around here? Oh, no. I am just an innocent salesman. Are you sure? You look an awful lot like Robespierre. <laughs> Oh, no. No, I think you mistake me for someone else. Hmm. You stay right there. I'm going right. to come down for a closer look. Well, okay, but I assure you, I have never been in this kingdom before. I'm sure I would recognize the place. It's a very nice kingdom and beautiful grass you have growing here. No, no, this place is all new to me. I believe this is the kingdom of uh, Mr. Uh, Long... Ooh. <laughs> you do look an awful lot like Robespierre. Oh, does Robespierre wear glasses? Why, uh, no. No, he does not. Well, perhaps you need glasses, Monsieur Knight. <laughs> do you think so? We, oui, not just any glasses. I have a special pair of glasses that will help you spot a robber from a mile away. Ooh. And they will only cost you one gold coin. Oh, <laughs> one gold coin? Yes. I simply must do it. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let me hold your sword while you try it on. Right? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. There you go. Beautiful. Oh, say, Magnifique, I will need that coin right now. Yes, here's one gold crown. I simply must have these. Excellent. Merci beaucoup. Uh, merci, merci, blah, blah. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on now. Hold on. With these eagle glasses, I shall be able to spot anything now and defend the kingdom with all of my... With all, all of my... Oh, wait, 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 wait. What? Where, where did my sword go? Oh, that salesman again. He took my sword? Ooh, I knew it had to have been him, but never fear. Now with these glasses, he shall never escape my sight. Hello, Monsieur Knight! Halt right there, Robespierre! I'm over here, and I am not Robespierre. Oh, no. Does Robespierre wear earrings? Oh. No. Then I could not be him. Oh, Monsieur Knight, I noticed that you cannot defend the kingdom without a proper sword. Perhaps you would like to purchase this one. You know, I do need a sword, and... Wait a minute. That's my sword! Robespierre! The jig is up! Get back here, Robespierre! You can't escape me! Where did you go? Get back over here! Oh, oh my Heidi! Get back here, Robespierre! Treasure room? Oh, yes. It's right down there. To the... <laughs> Wait a minute. It's on the left side of the hallway. The left side. Oh, thank you very right much. <laughs> Robespierre! Ah, get back here! Behind the fence. <laughs> I've got you now, Robespierre. We, oui, I am undone. 
That lesson here, Robespierre. Yes. You have robbed me of my sword, robbed me of my horse, I think. and made an unfair profit at my expense. Ooh, I'm so good day. That is no way to behave in the castle of my king. Do you not know that his house is to be a house for all nations? Oh, you are so forceful, so powerful. Do you know what you need? A badge. This one would be just perfect. It only cost you one gold coin. <laughs> no, wait, wait. no, no, no. I'm not falling for that again. Get out of here, Robespierre. You oh. would turn my kingdom into a den of robbers. Oh, well, all right. I don't suppose I could interest you in a used minivan. No, oh, get thee right. hence, Robespierre. And well, don't come back until you are ready to worship gun. my king and treat his house with respect. Kids, give yourselves a round of applause. You helped me defend the kingdom very good. Woo! But wait, wait. I'll find Penelope later, but we have learned a very valuable lesson today, that we must always treat God's house with respect and always honor the king. After all, serving the king is the noblest thing. Now I am going to find Penelope.